Hello and welcome to Advanced Driving Tuition. Uh, in this video, I'm going to teach you parallel parking, which is the reverse parking as well, they call it. Uh, there's a different method we use, different different method we use in uh, parallel parking. So we already made a one video for the parallel parking. That's the second video and that's to use a different met method this time. So again, to get ready, first gear, we look around to make sure everything's okay around us. We're going next to this black car. Same routine again, leaving a two to three feet gap from the reference car. For car to reverse gear, looking around, making sure everything is fine. This time, wing mirror should be in the middle again, as soon as there. This time we're only doing a one 360 degrees to the left hand side. Observation one more time all around. And then you're gonna keep an eye onto the wing mirror. If you keep an eye on the wing mirror, you can see three things there. You can see the curb, you can see the road, and you can see the body of your own car. So that makes a triangle. So one, keep on going back and make that triangle finish or disappear. As soon as you see the triangle disappear, which is just about now, you take the turn out, which you put one turn to the left, take it to the right. Put your wing mirror a little bit down, or you can use my blind spot mirror there. And this time, you have to do one full turn to the right side now. Look around to make sure everything is okay. Concentrate on the wing mirror. And slowly, slowly go back now. If you see, the curb is getting more and more visible. So keep looking at the curb and car will keep on going back. If you think the car is going away slightly, just take a tiny bit turn away. And you will get straighter and straighter. As soon as you see the curves in a straight line, take the turn out. Observation one more time, making sure everything's okay around us. And then just look over your shoulder and go back. If they ask you park in between the two car, you should be stopping with the tire and the tarmac. And if they ask you to park, leave a two car length gap, you should be leaving this much gap that gap is fine, parked perfectly. You can put your handbrake up, take the gear out, and you finish the maneuver. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you like the video. Please don't forget to subscribe, leave a comment, and share the video. Thank you. Bye.